Now, this man hasn't had a new wheelchair since he was a preteen. Now an adult, he needed a new ride to get around and to go to his favorite store, Target. Judy Proctor was ready to retire from nursing, but she had one more thing she needed to accomplish. I thought this is on my bucket list. Okay, and I thought, okay, and I'm just going to stick it out until we get the chair. A wheelchair for 27 year old Jimmy Carroll. Jimmy lives at the nursing home where Judy works in Reseda. He was born with a neurological disorder and has chronic respiratory failure and scoliosis. He's wheelchair dependent and he needs a ventilator to breathe. His current wheelchair is 15 years old and it was no longer holding a charge. So I started looking at stuff and was told that every five years there's, they can have a new wheelchair the patients that are like this. Jimmy uses his wheelchair not just to get around the home but to get out into society. Art it, the movies. How does it feel to be out? Wonderful. Feel like I'm free. But that freedom has been put on hold. After waiting more than a year for the wheelchair to arrive, it came without an attachment for Jimmy's ventilator. You can see what that attachment looks like here on his old wheelchair. So he needs to be able to travel with this here and this, yes. and it needs to sit back here. Yes, it does. Just like that other chair. The company that was paid $20,000 by Medicare for that wheelchair is New Motion out of Chatsworth. They provided something that was absolutely no good to him. I think that's a shame. Was the company aware that his chair would need to have a vent attachment? They took pictures of the chair. They took pictures of his existing chair. They took pictures of the back of the chair. And on the physician form Judy submitted to New Motion, it clearly states ventilator dependent 24 7. So Jimmy's new ride has sat in the corner of the nursing home for two months unused. Judy says she has been pleading with New Motion for a solution. It's very frustrating that New Motion will not give me an answer or tell me, you know, give me a fix for this. Judy was just about to give up until she turned on the news. There was your face. And I said, that's my answer. I said, I'm going to give her, I'm going to get in touch with her and see if she can help. So we contacted New Motion, and the very next day they sent someone out to meet with Judy and Jimmy. New Motion says Medicare actually didn't cover the vent attachment, so they're making something custom for him free of charge. Well, thank goodness for his advocate, his yes. nurse, contacting you to help uh, that child. And, you know, she said, what kind of life is it if you're stuck at home all the time? You know, right. Jimmy wants to go out and see a movie. Yeah. You know, it, it, you Sunshine, couldn't hear him there. He song. loves going to Target. I'm um, <laughs> doing things that we all love doing. Yeah. Um, so, you know, he wants to get out and do these things and not be confined to the home, even though it's a nice home. And so hopefully he'll be able to do that very soon. Right. Good for Jimmy. Yeah, <laughs> he deserves a break. And now <laughs> she gets to retire. Oh, she, said, right? she said she would not retire until he got his chair. And she actually <laughs> uses a walker to get around. So she Aww. is ready to retire and put her feet up. Um, but she said she would not do that until Jimmy got his wheelchair. Well, she deserves it too. And I have a feeling she'll still be helping people. I She'll think so probably too. still do that for the rest <laughs> of her life. Congratulations to you both. Mm -hmm. That's wonderful. All right. Can Two on Your Side help you? <laughs> Email Two on Your Side at CBS.com. Tell us about your problem. You can tweet us as well. Use the hashtag Two on Your Side. And Christine, we'll see what she can do to help you out.